Weinberg, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Nick Goldschmidt coming to you from Healdsburg in my office. Anyway, we've had solid day, 150 cabs, 2023 vintage. And so at the end of the day, we decided that we would open a bottle of 2022 River Pass Vineyard Alexander Valley in celebration of working with Weinberg because January 1 is fully on us. Um, and I'm excited to work with you all. And thank you, thank you for all the people that have met online or have spoken to in person. I'm putting together a little travel schedule at the moment. If there's if there's a big event that you want me to come to or um, some visit that you need me to do, please let me know. In the meantime, if there's any videos or trainings that you would like me to do about the wine, please let me reach out and I'll make a little video for you. Look at that. End of the day, screw cap. Easy. Don't have to think about it. Don't have to make my cork screw out. Wow, look at that. Purple color, red hue. Fantastic. Let's check out Alexander Valley. Boom! Yeah, blueberries. <laughs> You know what's interesting though, in 2022, I get a little bit of darker fruit than I would have normally expected. So I get the blueberry, the red cherry, the black cherry, but I also get a little bit of plum and blackberry, which is normally more typical of a warmer, you know, warmer area like Napa Valley, whereas Alexander Valley tends to be more red fruit. Wow, wow. Man, this wine is rich. I get a lot of the blackberry and the plum, but I still get that blueberry note all the way through. Fantastic, and the tannins are so silky. I'm really pumped about 2022. Can't wait for you guys to try it. Although 2021 is not bad either. Fantastic vintage. 2022 right in behind it. I just tasted the 23. We're looking good. Anyway, Winebow, Merry Christmas. Looking forward to seeing you in the new year. Take care. Cheers from River Pass Vineyard out here in the Alexander Valley. Sweet.